Hi everyone, and welcome to this video where I will simply explain how you can, uh, let's say, uh, create a segment in order to filter some pages. So basically this idea came to me after um, receiving strangely a lot of demands from uh, mainly libraries clients. So actually, um, it seems that when you manage actually um, the website of a library or set of library, one of the main uh, KPI you are interested in is uh, the pages that people are looking at. And um, as they are uh, very numerous, sometimes up to millions of pages, it's kind of hard to analyze, uh, let's say, the, the behavior of a set of pages. And there is just a basic uh, feature that you can use in Matomo, which is called the segment, in order to analyze those specific uh, pages in particular. So um, in this example, uh, I'm going to create a segment which will just analyze, let's say, uh, the data from the portfolio page, for example, plus a set of pages which are starting with Explore. So uh, the segment feature is just here. You just need to click on this button or even you can press uh, the S key of your keyboard. And then uh, you need to click here on add a new segment. So in my case, actually, I create one already, which is named Explore. And as you can see, I just name it Explore. And I just say, OK, give me all the page URL, which just start with uh, the beginning of uh, this domain name plus let's say, the uh, pages that I would like to extract. So as you can see, those are the pages which are uh, starting with Explore. And if I apply actually this uh, given segment, so apply, save and apply means, OK, give me, let's say, all uh, the pages which are uh, containing this condition. And as you can see, it's giving me all the pages uh, which uh, correspond to this given segment. And if I would like to get as well uh, the explore part, I will just uh, click here on edit. And I will ask, uh, let's say, the, uh, the the segment to give me actually the one uh, which deal with page URL. So page URL. So give me, yep, give me all of them, which as in my case, a portfolio. So that's going to be example something. Yep. Example like something and here yeah, it's portfolios port portfolio save it so here it's telling you okay um if you change this segment it means that actually the server will need to work and uh, as it's uh, requiring let's say a lot of efforts it's gonna take some time so this is basically what it's uh, doing according to the server that you have, it may take uh, a lot of time. So in some cases, yes, you have the time to go for a coffee. So in our case, uh, we can simply, let's say, um, uh, wait uh, right now. So it's kind of a lot of work here because it's, um, it's a full year that we are processing here in terms of data. So let's wait. And just set a timer or something, but it's 11.9. I think probably it's going to take two or three minutes. Let's see. So it's one minute left. So 
you can see that it's still working, right? You can see the MySQL part going up and down. So where it's MySQL. So two minutes left, okay, and then we got it, right? So we got portfolio here, and we got the explore, um, the explore part as well. So uh, this is how it works, and uh, as you can see, yeah, we have all uh, the pages which are concerned here, and you can like this analyze, let's say, all the data that you want. Of course, uh, if you want to do, um, let's say, more specific, let's say, segment, you can add either some or and uh, let's say condition but you can as well use uh, so is contained does not contain start with you can always use uh, contains in order to match uh, several url and so on and so forth so it's uh, kind of uh, let's say very powerful thanks for watching